此半决赛的对阵由西班牙队对阵塞尔维亚队。Representing Team Serbia, number thirteen, Marco Sub-Zero Zero. 站在十三号，马可 Sub-Zero。So a battle of unbeaten's about to go down in the semifinals. Team Serbia in the all-white, familiar with this squad, taking on Team Spain. Oh, we! Serbia coming off a 22 to 10 beatdown of the Netherlands, and Spain coming off an even uglier, a more lopsided victory, 22 to 6 over Uruguay. And number 16, well, this one should be pretty good, to say the least. Team Serbia versus Team Spain. So after 2012 World Championships, we're going to look at the brackets here. And our semifinals getting underway. The winner of this semifinal game will determine Serbia back in 2012, as I mentioned, the World Championships. And they won it, defeated Spain in the pool phase. Also at the 2014 European Championships, they beat Spain in the pool phase. They lost to Spain in the semifinals of the 2015 European Games and defeated Spain in the pool phase of the 2016 European Championships just last month. So uh, plenty of history between these two teams as both have been nearly perfect, certainly perfect in the record, but uh, nearly perfect on the floor and blowout victories. And now they get uh, warmed up and ready to go. But some great matchups across the board. You see the maestro and Rojas, of course, the number one player in the world. Dusan, Mr. Bulletproof, Bullet, likely to be guarded by Meras. Juan Vasco Trabado and Marco Savage. I mean, matchups across the board, you name it. This one should uh, should live up to the hype. So here we go in our first men's semifinal. Serbia and Spain. Spain in the red, Serbia in the white. Serbia starts with the maestro, Sub-Zero, and Mr. Bulletproof. Sub-Zero guarded by Juan Vasco Trabado. Quick shot on the maestro. And he's off the mark. The maestro missed some time this summer with an ankle injury. But uh, he's looked great out here so far with 18 points. Good for second on the scoring list, at least for Team Serbia. Dusan Bullet came into the day with 31 points and still leading all scores on the men's side, I believe. We'll double check that just to make sure. The Maestro, the drive, and the layup. And Serbia's on the board. Quick kick out to Sanchez with a bad shot. He makes the layup, and it's one apiece. The Maestro with a lazy pass has it stolen. And then Travado saves it. Bullet to Sub-Zero. And Sanchez now on Dusan. Maestro hesitates for just a moment. And his shot is off. Foul on the play. Maestro whistle. As Rojas will check in for Sanchez. One apiece. Okay, 
So these two rivals going toe to toe again with medals on the line. Savage clears it for Serbia. Quick cut for the maestro. Foul is drawn. And that's on the floor. So not in the process of the shot. Maestro to Savage. Savage looking for Dejan to cut baseline. And miscommunication between the two. Bullet, Savage, and Zero grew up in the same neighborhood, Lehman. Been friends since childhood. You can see that chemistry on the court. Those three on the floor right now for Team Serbia. Pull up from Dusan Bullet. Way long on the shot. Sub Zero gets the steal. Dusan swings it over to Savage. Who gets it back to Mr. Bulletproof. Rojas trying to stay in front. Mr. Bulletproof fires and he's on target. You know, Juan Vasco Trabado with the hook shot over Sub Zero. I mentioned these two teams' history at the beginning of this game and a big rivalry between the two teams as Spain beat them, beat Serbia in the semifinals of the 2015 European game. In this game, Bullet suffered a shoulder injury. You guys may remember after a hard screen from Trabado. So uh, those two won't be sitting down having a coffee together anytime soon. Bucket waved off, doesn't count. Foul on the floor, 2-1, Serbia. As the number one player in the world checks out. Sanchez to Trabado, Trabado. Out to Rojas, pull up Jay, he can't get it. Trabado gets his own rebound and scores underneath. Two apiece, sub-zero. Able to draw the foul on Trabado. He checks out, slaps fires with the referee. Marco Savage substituted out as well. So it's sub-zero, Dusan. And sub-zero, cold from outside. Sanchez, too long on his two attempt. So we're stuck at two with just over three minutes passed in this first semifinal game. And Neither team able to get any distinct advantage here in the first three minutes or so. TV timeout. And they're both going to get a rest and a chance to strategize here. At least for seconds or so. Savage, as Maestro wanted it, bullet hangs and doesn't hit. Now he's going against his good friend. I'm just kidding, of course. Trabado was able to draw the foul. Juan Vasco will step up to the stripe here and try his left on the free throw line. And 
looks good at the free throw stripe. So a three to two lead for Spain. The Maestro pulling up. And he's good. Maestro with the steal, but Rojas is there to recover it. Shot clock violation. Savage trying to protect uh, the pesky defense of Metas. Dusan hangs in the air long enough to fake the pass and make the shot. As Serbia leads five to three. And out of bounds on Team Spain. And Dusan Bullard and company will have it. As they're locked into a battle. A team that they, they don't get along with too well. Savage, two up, and he's short on it. Manus now, gives it to Travado. Travado! Oh, the spin, but no finishing. Then Bullet, then Bullet issues a foul. Make sure that he's all right as Travado gives us some theatrics. He's working on winning the Oscar. Okay, foul call on the floor. Met us. Strong rebound on the inside from Rojas, and the foul is called on sub zero. So Serbia has picked up five team fouls at this point. And Rojas is going to get a uh, free throw here as he was in the process of the shot. Only two fouls committed by Spain. 534 left in our first semifinal. Savage and bulletproof, bulletproof from long distance. Can't hit it. 5 4, still. Savage beat on the backdoor cut. And a nice score from Sanchez. And Mr. Bulletproof able to draw the foul. And he'll head to the strike. Maestro checks in. The sniper that he is. Hasn't gotten a bunch of open looks at the rim in, in this game. Credit to Spain's defense. Spain's last time competing in the World Championships again was 2012. They finished 13th. for Serbia, 4.51 on the clock. And the Spanish fans letting their team hear it. As the maestro gives a pump fake over to Dusan, bullet, pulls it. And it's right of the rim on the miss. Serbia, one foul away from being in the penalty. This is one 
of their weaknesses, maybe their only weakness, as they tend to get in foul trouble. But uh, the talent off, often is so good, it outweighs the, those fouling issues. Mr. Bulletproof. He's got the safety off. player in the world is looks uh like he's in some pain might have tweaked his ankle there he's having a discussion with the referees as uh he's moving gingerly on that left ankle One shot, meanwhile, for Savage. Toussaint's going to stay in the game. But, uh, not moving as well. Got there in time to defend that shot. Maestro jab step. And can't con connect on the long ball. Dusan being beat up. Oh, that, that wasn't any acting there. As he's uh he's bleeding from his lip. And it's gotten very testy between again. I told you two teams that are big time rivals that have met on big stages before and aren't exactly best buddies. Dusan, after tweaking an ankle, takes a shot to the grill, and, and he's going to have to be attended to by the medical staff with some blood on the right side of his face. So these two going at it like Ryu and Ken. Seven five lead for Serbia with under four minutes to play as we get to look back at some of the highlights in this one. It has been a physical game, a grind out type game. And it'll likely finish that way. There won't be any shorter physicality. Dusan's elbow also bleeding. And they wipe him off as he kicks it over to Savage. Maestro sets him a nice pick. Open look for Bullet. Oh! And he can't find the target as it goes in and out. Dusan called for the foul. And that's going to get Spain two free throws. Sanchez wants to dry off his hands before he puts his shot up, taking every precaution that he needs to take with a big game on the line here and his team leading by two against the 2014 silver medalist. Dusan Bullet and Company. Sanchez, good on the second as well. So it's seven apiece. The Maestro going to work. Savage. Long on his two, a great shooter. Blocking foul. On 
from Sanchez. And that puts Spain in the penalty as well. So now two free throws will follow for Savage. First free throw. Hey now. 29 year old Serbian star. He's going to hit the second one as well. So it's 9 to 7 in a back and forth battle so far between these two. Nice hustle from Medas to get the steal out to Rojas. Who chunks the deuces and he misses. Dusan Bullet calling for the pick from Savage. Dusan change of direction, pull up Jay, bang. 10-7, Serbia on top. Sanchez, right at Bullet. Savage. Misses the two, Bullet with the rebound underneath, and he scores it. Medas driving on sub-zero, his pass is stolen. Dusan clears it, crossover on Sanchez, spin move, fade away, and I ain't talking about the jeans. 12-7, Rojas. Straight in for the score, 12-8. Just over two minutes to play. Savage. Oh. Savage, nice control in the paint Savage. to get the score and then the awareness for the steal. Ah, but a bad pass. So he blew, a, blew the possession after a great steal. And timeout on the floor. As you can see, both teams bending over, sucking for air, dripping with sweat. Nobody willing to give an inch. Again, Serbia defeated Spain in the pool phase of the 2012 World Championships. Also beat him in the pool phase of the 2014 European Championships. Dusan gets a hand on it. And more recently beat him in the pool phase of the 2016 European Championships, where Serbia finished second. The Maestro has it swiped away, but Sub-Zero scoops it over to him. A bit of luck on that play, but they'll take everything they can get. 14-9. Travado gets the score. Warning on Team Spain, who obviously you can't stop the rebounding team. But getting the ball and clearing it. The next time that happens, it'll be a technical foul. Just over a minute to play, Serbia nursing a four point cushion. Bullet pulls it and has it rattled out, but the hustle for the rebound. Savage, what a pass! You wonder why they're so good. The passing to perfection. And pushing the back on Sanchez. So a couple of free throws now for Dusan. Spain is in the penalty, as you know. Our first semifinal of the day. And Dusan misses the freebie at the line. 49 seconds left. Serbia 
looks to move on to the gold medal game. Shot is blocked. Quickly kicked over. And Rojas can't get it to go. Travado goes off the glass. Sub zero clearing. Savage, beautiful backdoor cut as Bullet scores it. 17 12. Travado, nice pass, but looks like it's going to be a case of too little, too late for Spain. Don't want to count him out yet. A couple of two balls would change things, obviously. Dusan, oh, giving him the crossover step back, but he can't convert on the jumper. Only five seconds remaining. Manas launches one up. And it's going to be a 17 to 13 victory for Team Serbia. And they're feeling it. Pumped up. And they'll be moving on to the gold medal game here in Guangzhou. Spain still have an opportunity to medal here as they will play for the bronze medal. So the bronze medal game. Next up, it'll be Slovenia and USA to see who Serbia will be playing in that gold medal game. And the loser of that one will play against Spain for the bronze medal. But a knockdown, drag them out type game. As Serbia will advance to the final. Very physical game. Congratulations but who to will they play? You know this team by heart. And that was another very physical game. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's very physical because guys from Spain is very strong. It's a good defense on both sides. A lot of missed uh, shots for three points and for us, for them. But I think we, we play much aggressive defense and much better. And because we win, and I think we deserve to win. You're back in the final of the World Championships. Uh, remind me of how much it means to you. Oh, it it means a lot to me. Two years ago when we lose in the final, I was sad like I cannot sleep like one month. So now we need to play much better, much uh, more concentrated, and I hope we're gonna win. Last question: You had uh, an ankle injury five, six weeks ago. How are you doing now? My ankle uh, doing fine. I just have a little problem with energy because I didn't practice like three weeks. I just have practice five days before the World Cup. But it's great to play with these guys because they helped me a lot and without them I never make it this, this final for sure. Congratulations and see you in the final. Nice throw, get a little TV time. He's all smiles at the end of that one. Another look back at the highlights as the maestro got the scoring going for Serbia. Dusan Bullet was untouched at that point, but he had himself a, a very physical game. The layup goes down, and obviously the Spaniards are great passers. A skill that uh, Serbia certainly possesses, as we see Dusan Bullet pull it from the baseline, knocks it down. Marco Savage, who came in with 18 points after four days of pool play. Travado with the answer. And how about the pass? Savage is maybe the best passer out here. As the two rivals went toe to toe and blow for blow. And in the end, Serbia moving on to the gold medal game.